<laughs> and now for something completely different. Okay. You sound like a big old ogre. Mer. Everything's a struggle today. All right. <laughs> All right, so. I know it's not my fault. No, you tell me every day. It's my fault. <laughs> um. <Jesus>. Yes. <laughs> Can okay, I help you? <laughs> Holy loud trucks going by. What the feck? Would you <laughs> shut up? We live be we live <laughs> yes we live beside the highway so it's noisy sometimes. Le highway. Le highway, Trans Canada Highway. Oui, oui. The one that goes right across Canada. Yes. Goes right beside our house. And every truck in the world goes right beside our house. Air brakes and all. <laughs> we used to have a farm. Then they built a highway through it. And I saw her picking corn on the other side. <laughs> and as I stared at her corn hole, I said, hey, baby. And then she gave me two acres. Ah, if you haven't heard oh, that joke. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> okay, Max and Patty, part two. Yes. Um, we, we couldn't wait, so we just did this in the same day. So here we go. We wanted to see what happens. So we did it for us. Then we're going to have the ring. <laughs> and then we'll have it do it for you. Yeah. We did this for us, and then we'll do it for you. I don't, never mind. You perv. <clears throat> Max and Paddy's Road to Nowhere, sponsored by Chorley FM, where the listener comes first. Coming in your ears. Oh, they're in prison. Yeah. <clears throat> Right, four two two, you're in here. We're not in together, right? It's not the holiday in, son. Go on. I'll see you later. Yeah. Oh no. Four two three, you're in here. I'm sure you two will get on. <laughs> oh hi there. I'm Cliff. <laughs> Of course you are. Don't know where we're going, got no way of knowing, driving on the road to nowhere. Sponging for a living, checking out the women, riding on the road to nowhere. And we don't take shit from anyone. The only thing we want to do is have some fun. We're Max and Party, Holly and Max. And best of all, we don't pay council tax. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh yes, Tina. <clears throat> Alright love, good day. Yeah. You seen tonight's paper? Lad's not been yet. Useless. That news agent, it's supposed to be an evening paper. What's the tea? I'll be in in a minute. Daniel, will you come and move this way, please? I think you're right. I think she's going to help them get out. Yeah, maybe. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth. <laughs> you alright? No, no I'm not. I can't stand another night with him. Who? Hi guys. Mixed doubles. I've told you, with no balls, Cliff. That's okay. You can play with mine. See you down there. Ciao guys. Bloody hell, what are you in for? Have you never heard wired for sound? No. You've got to get me out of here, Max. I can't stand another night of that Millennium Pro. It's all right. Don't worry. I've already made a start. Just check the door. <coughs> I did this last night while everyone was asleep. 
What is it? It's a tunnel. <laughs> Shawshank. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on, man, get a grip. You're coming apart. Oh, God. Where are you tunneling to? Next cell. <laughs> Look, that was just a backup plan. I'm gonna get in touch with Tina at first chance I get. She knows we're innocent, she knows the truth. Well, you better do him quick. It's all right for you, you know. A good looking lad like me is a valuable commodity in here. It's all right, I've seen a pay phone. But what do you mean it's all right for me? When Paddy steps in them showers, those lads will think it's Christmas morning. They'll ride me like a Blackpool donkey. Look, what we've gotta do is let that lot think that me and you are a couple of hard nuts. I don't think we're a couple of big time gangsters. Come on, chest out, chin up. We're doing a bit of bird, as per. Me and you, Tango and Cash, Bowie and Doyle, Magnet and Steel. Eh? What do you say? Magnet and Steel. I'm gonna get bummed. <laughs> <laughs> I've never heard that phrase. I'm gonna get bummed. Chalky's the name. First time inside. And the rest. I've done more bird than Bill Oddy. We run the show up north. Control Clubland. You never heard of the Phoenix Twins? <laughs> twins? How long was the lead bar? I'll never forget what happened to the last fella who made that remark. What? I ate him. <laughs> what are you in for? We've just pulled off a big job. Gold, diamonds, you name it. Kids. What? I heard you stole a school bus. Full of kids. That's correct. We did. Wasn't the kids we're after, though. Oh, no. The loot was hidden in the boots. Police won't do a shoot with a bus full of kids. Always thinking. What happened to the loot? Nosy, isn't it? Nosey Parker. It's safe. As houses. Hey, Walt, watch yourself. All right, Wally. You know what today is, don't you? Collection day. I have tried. Well, you'll have to try harder, won't you? You don't want to let Raymond down, do you? You've got until the end of the day. Oh, sponge cake. My favourite. Oh. You don't have mind that. Jesus. Did she? It's very nice. Put the cake down, flower, and piss off. Oh, yes. Hold on. <clears throat> I don't think you know. <laughs> you play with feathers, you get your ass tickled. <laughs> What's going on down there? <laughs> Nothing, Mr. Jackson. <laughs> Everything's fine. <laughs> you play with feathers and get your ass tickled. Oh my god, I'm gonna like I gotta use that. Big mistake. <laughs> That's Pepe, Raymond the Bastard's girlfriend. Raymond the Bastard? What does he do? Apart from being a bastard, he runs this wing, and it's wise not to upset him. Tina, it's me, Max. Me and Paddy are in prison. I know. Well? Well, what? Well, you've got to get us out of here, love. Me? You're the only one who knows the truth. You've got to go to the police and tell them that I'm Daniel's dad. Then they'll know why I did it. No, no, it's not as easy as that, Max. I begged you to stay away and now look at the mess you're in. Well, you're not dragging me and my family down with you. I don't think you understand the crime. Oh. Tina? Oh. Have you phoned Tina? She wasn't in. I'll try again later. Shower sure time. Uh -oh. No. -oh. I'm dreading this. <laughs> <laughs> nice and steady. Nice and steady. All right. <laughs> Oh, it's crap, it's so. Here you go. Shower gel. Got the David Lloyd. Oh, dear. 
<laughs> you better bend over and pick that up. Who's on you? Who's on you? Lovely. <laughs> I think shower time's over. Fair enough. Not you two, though. Mm, oh, no. I'm Raymond. The bastard. <laughs> News travels fast. Well, we don't want any trouble. You should have thought of that before you wrap a steel tree around young Pepe's face. It was him. Was it? <laughs> Stunning. Like a young Burt Reynolds. <laughs> Look what you want. Well. Position for you. There are two ways you can live your life in prison. The easy way or the hard way. Um, a little blackbird told me that you pulled off a job before you come in here. Quite a big job. And that mm. money's tucked away somewhere. What if we did? I want 50%. 50%? 70-30 to us. 60-40 to Raymond. You've got yourself a deal, Mr. Bastard. <laughs> Lovely. It's a pleasure doing business with you boys. <laughs> I've got to hand it to you, Max. Stroke a genius. I can get used to this easy life. Oh, it's belting. I tell you something, we're better off in here. Duvet, Sky Plus, Terry's all gold. Is he? Chuck us, Matt. The room's purple. They do caramel barrels, Terry's. Mm. I've been thinking, though, what we're going to do when collection day comes. Don't you worry about that. We'll be out of here by then, son. Tina won't let us down. Oh, no, she's a good one. Trust me. Stick UK gold on, cop. Juliet Bravo's on at half past. Who's this ringing at this time? Be your man, won't it? This will be an hour. I'll pause it. This will be an hour. Hello. Tina, it's me, Max. Have you gone to the police yet? Oh, hi, Jean. Jean. What did the specialist say? The specialist. I think we've got a cross line here, buddy. Look, I can't talk. Oh, I see. Right. Have you gone to the police yet? No, and I'm not going to, so stop ringing me. Tina, you've got to go. I've not had a poo for five days. I'm chasing rainbows here, love. <laughs> Hello, Tina? No, thanks. Oh, <laughs> crack. The crack of Max. I'm frigged. You are? I'm frigged. <laughs> You think you get an easy job with Easy Life? Raymond said there's going to be a couple of vacancies coming up at Kitchen soon. He's just got to arrange for a couple of lads to get locked in deep freeze. Oh, that's nice, isn't it? We'll be in there next once he finds out we've been Billy bullshitting him. Have you spoke to Tina? I have. Don't worry. I've got it all under control. Hey, you two. What? You're a visitor. There you go. I said she won't let us down. I'm here, oh, boys. shit, it's Potter. <laughs> That's all we need. Christ almighty, it's a two tots. Are they doing a minstrel show in here? Black as arseholes. Oh, I don't like this. It's crack here, son. I'm just a head. Yeah, it's a piss take. I'm like a chad. Want no disabled facilities. <laughs> Not catered for this, have you? I can't hear you. What's, what's crack here, sunshine? I can't hear him. Talking to the phone. The phone? No change. They're not the craze. I can't reach. I don't even notice, but I'm disabled, eh? <laughs> can't get that. Come on. Thank you, Sorry. Emily. How are you? What are you doing here? I'm at, I've come get you. That's what I've come to do. Look at that. 
What's that? Petition of all founders' signatures there. Eh? Want to have you out for Christmas? It's August. <coughs> Sweet Jesus and Mary Chain. I'm not Perry Pissy Mason. I'm doing my best. Eh? That's all I can do. Here. I've got a cake here for you. Only Mary's made this. A cake? Yeah. You know, a cake. I know what a cake is. What do you want with a cake? No. He means a cake. I know what you mean. You mean a cake, <laughs> don't you? Yeah, that's right, a cake. <laughs> oh, a cake. You mean a cake. I think it's a pile in it or something. And what's in this cake? <laughs> Sponge and a bit of jam. <laughs> what do you want, son? It's real life. It's not the friggin' Shawshank Redemption. You can't stole a bus full of kiddies. You won't be in it first place. <laughs> it's not even a cake. <laughs> Oh, you're a pair of ungrateful guests, aren't you? There's me, rolling round like a blue-ass fly, getting T-shirts printed. This is all thanks I get. T-shirts? Free the Phoenix too. It worked for Deirdre Rashid. Oh, my God. Nine pound a throw. I've raised nearly three grand in bail money so far. But there's no bail. Is there not? <laughs> oh, well, I'll, uh, I'll put it towards the website, then. Website? Yeah, website. www.freemaxandparry.com Oh, it's, it's, it's big business, this amnesty like. <laughs> For you and the Phoenix, you selfish old goat. Selfish? I weren't selfish at half four this morning, but I was sat it back of a jumbulance with a puncher, freezing my tits off. <laughs> you want to try getting sent down nearer to home next time? Six hours it took me to get here. Unbelievable. Look, Brian, we appreciate all that you're doing, but we're doing all right on our own. <laughs> all right? You're in prison. Yeah, I know, Brian, but we're sorting things out ourselves, and you doing all this... Well, it might jeopardise our chances of freedom. You know what I'm saying? Just keep a low profile and don't do nothing. Promise. OK. That's what you want. Yeah. Do you swear? Well, like a nun with her ex. I strapped the sentence to the chair and I threw it down the lift shaft. And I pulled out my magnum and said, Go ahead, punk, make my day. Kiss, kiss, bang, bang. <laughs> did they catch you? Did they, did they balls? We got the goal out in Mini Coopers. They're small and fast. <laughs> Made a way home across the Alps. No. Easy movie. peasy. Satan grieves it. You pulled some jobs, you two. Uh, on the rest. <laughs> hey, lads, look at this. You're on a telly. Alison Gray. The two suspects look likely to be facing a long-term jail sentence. Now close friends and colleagues have got together to organise a special benefit in order to prove their oh, innocence. No. The problem I've had is fitting it in. We're chocolate block down here at the Phoenix Club, but we've been going and speed dating. But I thought, no, 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 first things first, let's free our two doormen. And is it true your local chart topper Mark Park is involved in tonight's benefit? That's right, yeah, we've done a special single for doormen in need. You can download it on the website from Monday and it's available as a ringtone. Whatever they said, whatever they did, they didn't mean it. We just want them back for good. Want them back. Want them back. It's pretty good, actually. Yo, yo, free the Phoenix too, y'all. The lovely lads. God bless them, they would do anything for anybody. They even did my big shop for me when they had my tubes rinsed out. I've known them all their lives. They used to serve under me as altar boys. They'd ring the bells and polish my chalice. They were both there the day I witnessed the miracle. Miracle? I just cut into a deep pan stuffed crust. And that's when I saw our Lord's face in a pepperoni. Whether the attention raised by tonight's benefit helps to prove the innocence of the two doormen remains to be seen. This is Alison Graham at the Phoenix Club in Bolton. Junction 5, M61, just past Balti Towers. <laughs> You're a couple of doormen. What about the gold and the Mini Coopers? Kick Potter, eh? He can't keep his big nose shut. I'm going to kill him. Not if I get to him first. Him and the bus is going to be coming for us now. Exactly, us. It should be you. Me? Yeah, you. You're the one who said, let's be a couple of hard nuts, making deals with money we've not even got, all for easy life. I did hear you moaning when you were watching Sky Porn. You were asleep anyway. We wouldn't even be in here if you hadn't tried seeing your son. 
Oh, so all this is my fault, is it? In a word, yes. Right then, OK. You go. I can handle myself. Thanks, a bundle. Against a prison? Yeah. <laughs> Mixed doubles, guys. Patrick O'Shea, Maxwell Bygrave. Come with me. Bygraves? By Graves? My mum were a big fan. All right. <laughs> In light of recent new evidence, it is the decision of this court that Mr. Bygraves' actions were carried out whilst under severe emotional distress, and we therefore have no choice but to terminate any custodial sentence. Hey, that'll ding dang do for us. Yeah. I told you, Tina, what they was doing. Oh, you heard that community service, though. Oh, 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 yeah. oh yes. Justice has been done. Yeah, justice. Correct. Too little, too late. The Bolton too. Yeah. Persecuted. That's what we've been. Five days of it have had in there. Have you seen Midnight Express? Absolute nightmare. I'll tell you one, sure in a cell with an absolute head the ball. Ah. Oh. Hello. My dad told me to give you this. He said he's made a copy. And what's your name? Daniel. Is it? Oh, I've got a little lad called Daniel. He's about your age. I'm starting big school this year. Are you? Ho, ho, ho. You'll be courting soon. Courting? You know, getting a girlfriend. Girls? Oh, no. Oh, you will. You'll find a girl and settle down. Oh. If you want, you'll get married. Look at me. I'm old, but I'm happy. <laughs> Just you take your time. Think a lot. Think of everything you've got, as you'll still be here tomorrow. But your dreams may not. That's poison. It's what? That's poison. <laughs> Let's catch Stevens. I'm going now. Okay, well, look after yourself and be a good lad for your mum and dad. Yeah. See ya. Come on. See you, son. Aww. 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 Ah, well, say la vie. Lovey. Lovey. What are we going to do now? Say Lovey. Oh, sir. Hello, is that the Home Office? Yes? Could you put me through to the Biological Weapons Department, please? <laughs> oh, my God, that's too funny. Revenge. Oh, God. 
Pompeii, if I can shit on the wall there. Oh my god, that was funny. Oh, fuck. Oh, it was okay. kind of sad, too. It it did bring a little tear to my eyes. I have to say, like, it, oh my god. I didn't think they'd have that uh, emotional aspect to the show. I thought it was just right. all silliness and that. But that's actually did a good job. the characters. Yeah. 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 Anyways, it was, kind of yeah, sad. It was really good. And they played, that was like one of my favorite Cat Stevens songs of all time. Just I can play it on the guitar. He plays it on Sunday. I love Sunday. it. I love that song. Yes. It is good. Oh my god. That was really good. I'm so glad we didn't wait till Thursday to watch that. Yeah. Okay. Well, I hope you guys Anyways. enjoyed it. I'll yes. get it on as fast as I can, as copyright will let me. And I uh, hope you enjoy that. We only have, Now we only have like two episodes left, so. Yeah. It's cool. going to be all over and be sad again. No. It's all good. Okay. It's all good. Hope you guys enjoyed that. I said that three times now. Okay. <laughs> I don't have any things. Bye. <laughs> and now for something completely different.